Alrighty, ladies and gents, how are you guys doing today? In this video, we are indeed going to be comparing the iPhone 4 versus the iPhone 5 and see how well it holds up. So the first test we're going to do is boot up both of these devices at the same time. Both are running the same apps, the files, the music, the email. This Both are just backups of each other. So, one, two, three. And as you've seen from the video which I uploaded yesterday, the iPhone 4S versus the iPhone 5, it wasn't too far off. So this really should be a significant bumpage in terms of speed. And both are showing the Apple logo. The iPhone 5 is just kind of dimmed down. So I'm assuming, yes, it would have been funny if this one, but we all know the iPhone 5 with the A6 processor, one gig of RAM, and it's the clear winner here. There we go. Well, hey, sometime today, today will do, sir. Sometime today will do indeed. Make me a coffee, love, while we wait for the iPhone to load up. That is really pathetic. Well, hey, here we go. And it's laggy. Does he lag it? Come on. Come on. There we go. So in this next test, we're going to load up Need for Speed Underground at the same time. There's no background applications running on either device. So one, two, and three. And there we go. The iPhone 5 again is really the winner. And of course, it's just going to perform much better when it comes to gaming in any case. And so in this last and final test, you can see we've got two projects here, both have the same file, both are 2 minutes and 48 seconds long, and we are going to export both projects in 1080p to our camera roll, and, or 720, so 1, 2, and 3. Let's see which one wins. And as you can see, the iPhone 5 is the Usain Bolt of the iMovies and the camera rolls. Let's zoom in and show you. Actually, both of them. <laughs> this is actually, um, I thought the iPhone 5 was just gonna come out as a champ, like a real true Usain Bolt. Um, but as you can see, the iPhone 4 is not that far behind. Um, so for those of you who are wanting to edit the next Terminator or the Taken movie or the Superman or the Batmans on your iPhone uh, or any Hollywood styled film, this is uh, the kind of speeds you are talking about. Not that far off. The iPhone 5 is just, just about to reach halfway, not yet. Um, the iPhone 4 still proving it can do something. It can at least get a silver medal. Not a gold, but a silver. And the iPhone 5 has reached halfway, and the iPhone 4 is not too far behind. But there we go, ladies and gents. I hope this video has helped. The reason why I'm doing this video um, is just to show you, if you are coming from a 4, this is the kind of speed bumps you can expect. Uh, I did do a video yesterday again with the iPhone 5 versus the iPhone 4S and that was um, kind of on par with all three tests. The iPhone 4S wasn't that far behind um, but the iPhone 4, you've seen at the boot up test, the iPhone 5 won that. The gaming, okay, the gaming, the application launched. The iPhone 4 wasn't too far behind but the iPhone 5 still won. This final test here, the iPhone 5 is won, and the iPhone 4 is reaching here. iPhone 5 is done, and now the iPhone 4 is slowly, but surely, making its way. If you did get an iPhone 5, how are you feeling? Uh, you know, feel free to leave a comment or a video response. If you've done tests yourself, you know, by all means, leave a video response. You know, was the upgrade worth it for you? Do you really think now that you've kind of had that launch day urge to give your hard earned uh, dosh over to Apple, was it worth it? 
and that is it ladies and gents for this part, is it stuck? No, I think it just takes a lot of time to render. This isn't my phone, so these bubbles that you're seeing in the screen shield, that is not how you install a screen shield. But there we go, ladies and gents, I hope this has helped. Feel free to leave a comment below, or abuse, rage, whatever, love, I'd like that to be honest. Only if you're female. Feel free to join me on Twitter, ask me questions on Twitter if you want, I'm more active on that than I am on Facebook. But in any case, feel free to check out eyeglassregion.com and I shall see you in another life. Cheers!